Investigators are trying to determine what caused a car crash that killed Republican Congresswoman Jackie Walorski and three other people. It happened near Elkhart, Indiana, yesterday. Lawmakers from both political parties offering their condolences, some releasing statements, others speaking publicly about her death. Kelsey Kernstein is here now with the latest on this tragedy. Kelsey? Yeah, Mitch, she died in a head-on collision in the early afternoon of yesterday. In her home state, her peers and community devastated. Flags flying at half staff on Capitol Hill after a beloved congresswoman died. Deputies say 58 year old Jackie Walorski, who represents northern Indiana, was killed in a head on crash on a country highway Wednesday. The fierce Republican serving in Congress since 2013. She was a wife, a one time missionary advocating for anti abortion laws, restoring energy independence in the U.S., and more recently, help for Ukraine. The American people are suffering. The American people don't feel like they're represented. The Elkhart County Sheriff's Office says the SUV Walorski was riding in was hit by another car that drifted over the center line, killing her and two staff members, Emma Thompson and Zach Potts. The woman driving the other car also died. House Minority Leader Kevin McCarthy announcing the news, calling it absolutely devastating, adding Jackie was a trusted advisor and the embodiment of integrity. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi issuing a statement saying she was loved on both sides of the aisle for her personal kindness. Walorski's colleagues from Indiana also shining light on their friend's hard work. She loved the Hoosiers throughout the state. Um, she had an incredible sense of humor. Incredibly smart, so talented in, in, in many ways. Jackie, one of the first great Hoosiers I got to know on my own journey. She will be missed, and our condolences to all of the families. And President Biden and the First Lady also issuing a statement saying they are shocked and saddened. We do know that her husband has been notified, asking for prayers pending funeral services. It's tragic. Thank you, Kelsey. What a life and legacy she left, Absolutely. truly. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.